Setting objectives is vital, but identifying your insecurities and concerns is even more crucial. Ask yourself this question right now, what am I embarrassed or ashamed of? What am I concerned that others might learn about me? Next, compile a list. Your greatest insecurities are on this list. Don't feel ashamed, we all have them. Making this list alone won't make them miraculously vanish, though. But doing so will make it easier for you to accept them as real. I advise you to choose one and share it with a close friend or member of your family if you want to get over them. Although it won't be simple, doing this will help you get rid of the related shame. Exercise accepting rejection. We are concerned that we won't be able to live up to our own and other people's expectations. And it absolutely terrifies us. This is common. But if you allow your fear to keep you from pursuing your goals, you will never succeed. Instead, you must make an effort to confront this anxiety every day. The only way to go over it is in this way. Introducing yourself to one girl each day, for instance, and complimenting or seducing her. These comfort zone challenges will help you become less sensitive to your concerns and stop caring what other people think. Practice making decisions. You need to have the ability to act quickly if you want to feel truly confident. The majority of us make the error of overthinking and overanalyzing each and every decision. Because you're essentially teaching yourself to question your gut feeling, this will make you feel less confident in yourself. You must instead strengthen your decision-making muscle. Daily decision-making exercise is necessary. Explore new hobbies. You must try new things if you want to have more confidence. If you spend all of your time in your comfort zone, nothing will ever change. Experimenting with new activities is one of the finest ways to mix things up and step outside of your comfort zone. You never know, you might uncover a passion you had no idea you had. Alternatively, you can make a new best friend, or girlfriend. The self-love affirmation. The last hack is a straightforward affirmation. Short phrases called affirmations are repeated to oneself to improve your mood and hypnotize yourself into believing them. The I love myself affirmation is the most successful one I've ever tried. This is how it goes, say I adore myself 5 to 10 times while gazing at yourself in the mirror. This may seem incredibly simple and even strange, but trust me, it works. You may find it awkward at first, but if you say these phrases every day for a few weeks, you will soon begin to experience genuine love for yourself.